cold start. Haven't driven it in about two weeks. Feels like it's like 60 degrees on that. I could do a walk around. So it's got the BMW Motorsports badges. There you can see the clear coats peeling. It's not, I think, yeah, there's no cracks really. It's just, I've hit, I've hit, I've hit a couple things and it, it cracked the clear coat, but not bad. And it's got the uh, carbon fiber slim bones fog light covers too. And it's updated headlights, fog lights, basically everything. Here you can see the rock chips hopefully. 136,000 miles. There's some rock chips at the leading edge of the hood, but really not bad. Feels still good. No dents on the car. Really, really clean. There's a little chip right here on the door. Uh, and then, like I said, the minor rock chips on the front. I'm trying to find I don't think there's anything else. Any other scratches or anything. It's got the BMW Heritage black interior. No rips. Carbon fiber trim. Got the Euro center console, Kobe wheel, Alcantara, everything, shift boot, tricolor stitching. I put this on here. I was actually planning to slick top the roof and go LTW. That's the other thing. If you've never been in a Euro dash car, the legroom is insane. Check that out. And it lines up with the door panel, unlike the US cars. There's the individual trim. 
sill plate. It's got the, uh, I put the Euro base. I have the original base. It's got the ski bag passed through to the trunk. Really good condition. No saggy headline or anything. Those stickers are worn off, unfortunately. It's got the BMW um, windshield visor. got the um, Hella facelifted tail lights, perfect shape. Sunshades, perfect condition working. Little bit of wear on the handle, but not ripped or anything. Memory seats work, no twisting, all operational. Again, there's the Kobe wheel Alcantara face lifted steering wheel. See if I can do a little. Start a new video. There it is.